I know my voice is better than ever at the moment. Yes. Yeah. And because I take it back serious like when I was in my twenties. Yeah, right now my voice is really good. It has something in it that it didn't have growing up. And you know, like some places open up. There's a thing at the right side of my throat. It used to feel like, you know, there's something stuck there. So I went to the doctor and I told the doctor. And the doctor said, no, not nothing, you know. She tell me she told me what the problem was. And that I could just like I could just get rid of it with some tablets. And from that, that kind of feel at the right side of my throat. It's gone and it's coming like my, my, my throat open. And this has been going on for years, you know. Like I was just singing with half of voice. You know, half of my voice. You know? Now my voice is full. You know? Me and Gregory Isaac and Tabby Diamond used to live in the same yard. Uh, four roads of that side, you know. And uh, I heard that song singing and Tabby said, I love it. And I said, Tabby sing it, you know. Uh, but in the end, surprising to me, I said, I, I don't know which one of the group member. But I feel there's one that named George. I did some of them to go off feelings. I say they, 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 they retitle the song and put their name on it. Retitle it as Black Man Fighting. Yeah, after my song already came out on, on an album with diamonds called Deeper Roots. And you see my name, Erlo, on it. I think that's one of my best songs too, you know, that I write, you know. I feel it, you know. I don't put any song to that song. Maybe that's why I let Tabby sing it. Because I know it could get more attention if I did it. More attention with Tabby, more than I did it, you know. Uh, because you channel one for it. The set of musicians and, you know. Yeah. Yeah. With me, it could just be a song. Yeah, but it could be a, it'd be a better song if Diamond sang to the air. Operation at the time. I, I don't feel I write another song so pass that song. Tribal War, good song, prophecy, good song, Bongo Naya, good song. But Black Man is a different song. What was it like working with Adrian Sherwood? Adrian is my friend, you know. Mm. Can just put it, I can just put it down to that, you know. And we had some nice times together. You know, in the studio, you know, working with Bob Les because he had a studio in Waltham too. We are recorded for him, and uh, although I wish the songs were were more, I would say some of those songs, you know, you noticed know, it was like just computers, you know, electric drum and. You know, keyboard, bass, and those things, you know. I would prefer it were if it was a set of musicians, you know. Yeah. How did the link up with Prince Fatty start? Prince Fatty was around Adrian, you know. It's like the link was there, you know. And I was doing some work for him. He asked me, and he, he, he linked me and said, I was doing some work with him, some different songs. And then he asked me to do some Nirvana songs, an album, an album of Nirvana. It was something new for me, because I didn't even know about Nirvana. It's the first I I heard about Nirvana. Eh? I started listening to songs to record, you know? Kind of like it was fun in a joke, you know. But it came out good, you know. Yeah, I had fun doing it, you know. And 
it got a good response, you know. People loved it, you know. It took me to many places, you know? And I went to Australia to perform that album. I did some festivals with people, maybe I wouldn't, you know. I get to associate with those people. If it wasn't for that album, you know. Uh, yeah, and I will say it took a lot of people by surprise when it came out. Yeah, yes, it's true. Lord, yeah, yes. So last year you put out two albums, which was God is Good for Love Injection. Yeah. Yes. And uh, Woke Up, which was um, a Zion High production. Yes. Yes, God is Good. Um... Bridging that owner, the the, the 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 label, his name we call him Spider. He's been a producer for a while now. Makes make songs with yeah, recorded songs with many artists. Michael Ruth, Ben Washington, you know. They didn't came out uh, as I wished it would. Yeah. Cause there's some great songs on it. Yeah. I've listened to his productions before, like with Michael Rose and Glenn Washington and stuff. And it was always great productions. I just felt like the mix on God is Good wasn't what it should have been, you know? Yeah, the mix, they didn't spend time for the mixes. Now with Woke Up that you did with Zion High, how did that come about? I don't know, you're an artist and... People will link you from all over, you know? Because Jaddy, you know, he came to he came to England here when he was touring with Janine. Cause you know he's the he's the bass player for Janine. Yeah. So you know, we, we met up in a studio in Brixton, you know. And he brought the idea to me for me to, you know, do some so in street head. It's my good region, isn't it? Mm. I so, have a show next month. Um, no, not next month. October, 13th of October. It will be a great show. It, it is four of us. Big Youth, Meditations, Linval Thompson, and Croy. Yeah, great show. Yes. 